We're gonna do three exercises to warm up. Toes facing me, yeah. Yes! Okay, you're gonna step when it bounces, ready? Step, hit. Now hold, don't move. This is exactly how I want you to finish. It's all about the discipline of understanding each position. It's okay that it's choppy because we can make it fluid later. The hardest thing with kids in tennis is they don't feel successful because it's hard. Working with a foam ball in a rally gives her the success and the feeling of an elite player rallying on the court. So she gets a taste of that and it makes her want to play more and more. You rallied! Excellent, let's do it again. Step hit. That was your absolute best one. That's when you go like this, you go, come on! Can you say it? Come on. Come on! High five. That is the way to finish a lesson, Lizzie. You are all done. That was great. Are you ready? One, two, three, go. Two laps. Let's go. Good job. Good. Okay, line up right here. We're going to do three exercises to warm up, okay? So right here, you get to pick, because I know you remember some of my exercises, yes? So start right here. You're going to go to the white line and back. Which one do you want to do first? Remember we have like butt kickers, shuffle, skipping, bunny hops, remember all those? Which one do you want to do first? The goal of our channel is to help kids play tennis all around the world with quality coaches. Skipping, so skip there and back, go. Ooh, that's more of a shuffle, look. Look at me, skipping. Can you try that? Ready? Do it with me. Yeah, so oh, so we have to learn to skip. That's fine, that's cool. Good job. Okay, so now let's shuffle back. Let's face each other. Kind of our toes have to face each other the whole time, okay? Put our arms right here, ready? Shuffle. Toes facing me, toes facing me. Yeah, that was excellent. Okay, take a breath. Okay, can you grab your racket? I have a new racket you like have a new my racket? brothers. It's the same. Look at that. Can I see you hold it? Wow, that's really cool. It's so tight that I could hit. I love so it. So hard. You hit so hard. That's great. Okay, so we're gonna do one thing before we start. Put your racket right here. You're gonna hold this cone in this hand right here. Okay, just one hand only. Can you hold it with one? I'm gonna toss it. You have to try to catch it in the cone after one bounce. Are you ready? So bounce, catch. Oh, success. Now throw it back to me. Kind of just chuck it out of there like this, watch. Okay. So put your arms out, remember zero out here. Yeah, okay. One hand only now, good. One bounce, go, 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 yes! Now go back, throw it out to me, throw it out to me. Yes, just like that, okay? Zero, push your arms out. You're gonna hold it with one hand, good. What if I did it this high, can you do it? Oh, good try, grab it and throw it back to me. <laughs> got it. You've gotta get three more catches. Okay, here we go. Why don't you try your other hand? Oh, yes, high five, good. Put it in the basket, good job. Okay, now you're gonna grab your racket and we're gonna go over to the mini net, okay? You're gonna follow me. I can run over. This is gonna be your starting point right here, okay? You're gonna put your feet, one foot on this, one foot on this. Good, that's your starting spot. Where's zero? Good. Now, if I wanted you to hit forehands, I wanted you to run to here, how would we set up when we turn for a forehand? When I say one, zero, one. What happens to this arm on a forehand? So for her, the, the confidence of knowing each position, knowing how to hold that racket in each position, and then the concept of just running to a spot and not have to worry about doing multiple things at once for her. On a forehand, how many hands do we hold? Two. On a forehand. Backhand we hold two. Is that right? So a forehand, how many? Did you just show me a forehand? How many hands did you hold on the forehand? My brother does. This yes. With Coach Voss. Good. So a forehand has one hand, right? And then what does this arm do when it's only one hand on the racket? What do we do with the other hand? What does this arm do? What is it called? Spider Man. Spider Man. So you're going to pretend that you're shooting your web, right? Like that. So you're going to go zero. And then when I say one, you're going to set up here like this, right? Then when I say go, you're gonna run all the way to here, set your feet in the circles. Good, you're gonna wait like this, your toes are gonna be this way, boom. Then I'm gonna drop a ball for you to hit right here. When I drop it, this foot steps onto the red. Pretend like you're stepping, and then you're gonna swing and finish. And then how do we always get back to the middle in tennis? Do we walk, do we run, or do we run, shuffle? Run, I think we shuffle. What does a shuffle look like? Show me zero, now shuffle. That's gonna be our drill. 
You stay in zero for me. We simplify it by calling ready position zero. And when we practice ready position, we really train them to press their arms way out, way farther than you would probably have them because once you relax, now they're here. Versus if you train like this, then when you relax, you get even closer. This really creates space when they turn so they don't overrun the ball. So we have zero ready position. Then from here, one is the turn. So when we say one, they know to turn. Then we say go, they know to run. Then they get their feet set. Two is all about this, the drop and hit. So when the ball bounces, they're saying two as they hit the shot. And then we really try to get them to focus on freezing the finish, being able to have balance. Especially at this age, they tend to fall over. So really trying to get them to stick the finish at the end. All right. Okay, you're in zero, right? Face that way in zero. What's one? Where's your Spider-Man arm? The Spider-Man arm points all the way to that fence. Yes, now go. Good, ready? And we're gonna, when this bounces, you step. Ready, step, hit, oh my. Now back to ready, back to zero, shuffle. Good job, excellent. Okay, zero, one. Oh, look at the Spider-Man arm right away, go. Good feet, now toes always this way. Yeah, there we go, there we go. Boom, boom. When that ball bounces, you step here. Okay, ready, go. Oh, wow, can I do one thing now? When you finish, can you hold it here? Can you freeze? Can you pretend that I'm, I have the powers to go freeze? And you're like this, and you have to hold. Can we try it again? So let's have you here like this, toes this way. Good, Spider-Man arm out. Good, hold the bottom here, open. Bottom of your grip, good, excellent. Now I want you to hold your finish, okay, over your shoulder. What Ready, step, here? you are. Now do it again, turn. Okay, you're gonna step when it bounces, ready? Step, hit. Now hold, don't move. This is exactly how I want you to finish. Hey parents, if you enjoy watching our videos, you should not forget to like. Do you see where your racket is? See how it's over here? That looks really good, can I get a high five? Now back to zero, shuffle. Very good, very good. Okay, zero, zero. Okay, push your arms out a little more. Yeah, there we go. One. Oh man, look at that, go. Good, toes pointed this way. So you know how we're running? Yeah, just keep the toes in that same running position. Good, right here. Okay, wait for the bounce, step, hit, freeze. Put your foot back, get back in the one. Yeah, ready, and step, hit. Now, did you, step, did you forget your step on that one? A little bit, so let's try again. Okay, go in one. Spider-Man arm, show me. Okay, you're gonna step when this bounces, ready? Step, hit. Now, did you, now that's a good shot, but did you step or did you keep your feet where they are? Did you forget the step? Yeah, so go back. Okay, get in your one position, Spider-Man arm. Good, good. Toes this way, ready, pull, yeah, there we go. Spider-Man arm. Right when the ball bounces, this foot comes to here. Are you ready? Go. That is it. Now, even though you missed it, did you actually do the swing correctly though? You did, so let's try one more time. That was great. Get set. So one, Spider-Man arm, show me. Good, wait for the bounce and then step. Ready, step, hit. Did you do it? And did you finish really well? High five. Zero. Shuffle, go, excellent. Okay, four more and then we'll do the backhand. So four more forehands, okay? So zero, good, push your arms out, good. Yeah, there we go, okay, one, go. Wait for the bounce, eyes here, wait for the bounce, step, hit, freeze. Zero, zero. That was so good. Shuffle. Good job. Okay, three more. She did great. I told him. Is that your microphone? I don't know. Here, say hi. Hi, Dad. Hi, Dad. Ready, zero. Okay, look at your feet. Look down at your feet. One foot on each side. Remember? We want one foot on each side of the circle. There you go. Okay, now zero. Push your arms out. Okay, one. Go. Good. Arm across. 
Spider-Man arm out. Spider-Man, yeah, there we go. Wait for the bounce now. Bounce, step, hit. Good finish. Zero, shuffle. Excellent. How many more do we have now? Good. Okay, ready position. Zero. One. Go. Set your feet. Good. Wait for the ball. Stay in like this, remember? Stay like this. Good. Wait for the bounce. Go. Yes! That was like your best one. Back to zero. Shuffle. Excellent job. Okay, how many more do we have? How many more do we have? One more. Okay, so what do we say at TMX? We say last one, best one. Last one, best one. Okay, ready? So zero. Push your arms out. One. I didn't even say it yet. One. Good. One. Go. Good. Waiting. Arm across more. Yes. Wait for the bounce. Step. Hit. Was that one of your best ones? Yes, it was. High five. Go get some water. Very good job. We'll do backhands next. At home, we have like this little wall. We like feed it to her. Yeah. And then she only takes her forehand. At the backhand, she just doesn't swim. You know what though? My favorite shot as a kid, and even today, is my forehand. Same. Um, I have to work a lot on my backhand, but guess what? You know what's cool about a backhand? Is you get to hold with two hands, so you get to smack it more. Right? Yeah. You have two hands, you get more power, boom. We just did, what shot did we just learn? What was it called? Forehand. And how many hands do we hold on a forehand? Two. Forehand? <laughs> How many hands are on your grip right now? One or two? One. Ah, so how many hands do we hold on a forehand? One. How many hands do we hold on a backhand? Two. Good job. Okay, come to the middle, okay? Show me zero. <laughs> so yeah, good job with your feet. It's the exact same thing, but now we're doing it on the backhand side. So when I say zero, right, you're pushing your arms out together, both hands on the racket the whole time. When I say one, Right, we take the racket back like this. Now I'm gonna say go, ready, go. Right, we're gonna set our feet. Our toes are always this way, right? Toes are always that way. There we go, good, we're waiting like this, okay? Then, you're waiting for me. When the ball bounces, this foot is gonna step right here onto this red mark, okay? So pretend, ready, step, step, swing, finish. And you're gonna always finish with both of those hands on. Okay, so go back to ready. All right, so zero, one. That was forehand, now we're gonna do backhand. Good, now see your strings are here. I want you to point your strings at your dad. See how your strings are pointed there? Okay, now hold it like that. Now go, ready, go to the circles. Good, now you're gonna wait for me here like this. When the ball bounces, you're stepping with that foot. Are you ready? So we're gonna go step, hit, there it is. Now we're gonna hold the finish like this, hold. Like I'm gonna take a picture of you. Right? And now back to zero. Back to zero. Shuffle back. Yes, very good. Okay, now you know. Zero. Okay, can you put your hands a little more like this? Watch. Open your hands. There we go. Okay, zero. One. Good. Go. One, one. Good, stay there. Wait for the bounce. Step, hit. Yeah, do it again. So go put your foot back. Let's do it again. Turn. One, wait for the bounce. I think we should try again. Put your foot back. We'll try again. Okay, right here. You're gonna wait for that bounce and then you're gonna step hit. Eyes here, eyes here, step, hit. Good try, but hey, here's the deal. The second it bounces, you're gonna go ha You gotta swing right away. You wanna try one more? Here, okay, you're gonna wait for the bounce. Good, toes this way. There we go, good, boom. Okay, one bounce and you're gonna smack it. I dare you to try to hit me. You wanna try to hit me with it? You have to swing after the first bounce, ready? Go. Look how great that backhand was. Now, can you give me the step? So you're gonna step and do the same backhand you just did. That was so good. Okay, ready? Wait for the ball to bounce, go. See how you waited to swing? I want you to swing right away. Do it again, go back. You're doing great. Is this why you kind of, you struggle on your backhand sometimes? We're gonna make your backhand so good. Okay, right here like this. All right, when the ball bounces, you step and you're swinging at the same time. So it's like this, here, boom. Okay, ready? Try to hit me, step and hit. Look at that, shuffle back, that was excellent.
It's your time to shine. I know, it's good. Right here. It's all about you, Lizzie. All right, zero, one, good. Point your strings at your dad. Yes, good. So we're gonna hold this hand more here like this, watch. There we go. Okay, now go. Set your feet, good. Wait for the bounce, step hit. Good try, put your foot back. One bounce only. One bounce only and you're gonna smack it, ready? Go, there it is. Shuffle back, shuffle back. You're silly, huh? Are you the, are you the, the jokester? Do you like oh, the- Oh, she's, she's the boss. Oh, you're she's the, boss? the boss? Yeah. Oh, okay, I like being the boss too. Good job, girl. Okay, zero, we're gonna do three more, okay? So push your arms out in one. Push your arms out in zero, zero. Push your arms out. Now one, keep your arms out. One, there we go, point your strings. Good, this hand comes here. You'll learn it, don't worry. Okay, go. Wait for the bounce, eyes here. Ready, eyes here, wait for the bounce. Uh-oh, if you look over there, you don't know. You gotta look here. Eyes here, ready? We're gonna go bounce, hit. Now, can you give me one where you step? So good, your turn in one. Right when it bounces, you step. Are you ready? Eyes here, eyes on the ball. Go. Yes! Shuffle back. Oh, get a little dance. We can have celebration dances. Zero, push your arms out. Good, one. Yeah, oh look, you're correcting yourself. I didn't even have to help you. Good job, go. Okay, wait for the bounce. Step, hit. Yes, do it again. Rack it back, put your foot back again. Point your strings this way. And my mom makes me mini sandwiches. Mini sandwiches, that sounds so good. Okay, ready? Wait for the bounce, step hit. That was your absolute best one. High five. Shuffle back, two more. I have two more, Gaga. Two more, okay. Zero, one. Good, check your strings. Where do you want the strings to point? Good, good job, go. Wait for the bounce, step hit. Yes, go put your foot back, we'll do one more. Turn, rack it back, eyes here. Step hit, yes, shuffle back. Zero, make sure you're in zero when you shuffle. This is what we call match point. What's match point mean? Match point means this is it, you get one chance to hit the best shot ever. Are you ready? What do we say, last one, best one. Can you say it? Last one, best one. Good, zero, <coughs> one. Oh, oh, you, good try, zero, one. Good. Check your strings, where do we want those strings to point? Good, go. Wait for that bounce, step, hit. Oh, guess what, we get to do another. Ready, go back to the middle, let's start again. Let, you know what's fun about practice? We get to go and try again. Start over. Okay, ready, zero, one. Check your racket and your strings there, yeah. Now eyes on the ball, go, eyes on the ball. Good, eyes on the ball, turn the toes. Good, where are your toes? That's better. Okay, wait for the bounce now. Eyes here, bounce, step, hit. Give me a dance, that was your best one. Give me a celebration. Yes, high five. Get some water. The biggest thing for me is when they turn, it's hard for them to understand to turn the head. When I tell her to go, I'm letting her watch the ball so her head's here as she's running, kind of learning how to watch the ball as they're moving. So really simplifying everything at this age and making it super fun. Do you maybe want to try to rally it over the net with me? We can use a foam ball and try to tap it back and forth. Look, I got my special foam balls here. We're just gonna kind of tap it back and forth. I'll hit it to your forehand. So can you get in your one position? Spider-Man arm, good. Right here. Oh yeah, I got it. Can you do it again? Go oh my, over my head. That's incredible. Over okay. oh my head. Ready, zero? Let's try the backhand side now. So one on the backhand, hit it to me. Good try, ready? One, backhand, good. And now I want you to step and hit it. So step, hit, yes, you did it. Try the forehand. The forehand is my best. Spider, I know, you like it. What is it called when you and I try to hit the ball over the net back and forth? Do you know what it's called? Rally. Rally. Can you say rally? Rally. So you're learning how to rally by hitting the ball back and forth with me. 
Right now, let's make our goal four. Can we do it? Back it up, let's try. Good, ready? You're gonna tap it to me, go. One, two, go. Three, four, go. Five, you rallied. Excellent, let's do it again. Okay, here it comes. Right here, bounce hit, go. One, ah! You already beat me. How did you do that? That was awesome. Okay, last ball, last ball right here. Can you kick that one out of your way? Good, okay, zero. Let's do backhand, okay? Turn for a backhand, one. Yeah, there we go, eyes here, eyes here. Yeah, one, two, go, 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 three, ha! Go, forehand, forehand. Yes, ready, forehand again, go. Yes, oh, I got it, oh, backhand. What, a, forehand. What, backhand. <laughs> That's when you go like this, you go, come on. Can you say it? Come on. Come on. High five. That is the way to finish a lesson, Lizzie. So really simplifying everything at this age and making it super fun. Hope you like the video and like the video. Get it? <laughs>